So now that we have the forecast, let's plot it to get a better understanding of the forecast. And we see that the forecast data frame has the date, the estimated values, the lower range of the estimated value and the higher or upper range of the estimated value. And we see that for the training period, the model has captured the trend that is present in the data. And it also made a forecast for the next 12 months. And if you look at the confidence, which is the light blue shades around the blue line. So the confidence interval is or error interval is not that wide, meaning we have a better confidence or higher confidence in the forecast. If it is too wide, then the model has a lower confidence in the forecast.